So when you are putting the harness on, you want to make sure that you have the three prongs in your left hand and then this other nice clip in your right hand. So when the three prongs are in your left hand, that will allow this nice big space for your dog's head to go through. Once the head is in, this will drop straight down on the chest and then you'll pull these under and around your dog's legs and up to clip on each side. Um, so I will show you it with Brody. So the prong is in my left hand, it's going to go right over his head, good oh boy. Then you can see this chest strap is dropping down right here, high test, perfect, oh boy. So with that dropping down, I'm going to bring one side up over and clip it there. And that leaves one more side dangling, I'm going to bring around his leg and up to clip it. You can't clip them on the wrong side because the pieces won't fit in together. So that leaves you with one clip in the front, and then here we go. Here we go. And then one clip on this back side here. So with your, your dual clip leash, you're gonna to wanna to use both because it will help to align the spine as they turn. So you'll put one clip here, the other clip right on the front, and then you'll have these two leashes. You wanna make sure that the two leashes are on the side that you're walking on and then this handle will float with you. So as you walk, as you walk, it will just help you keep that body in alignment. Um, what you can also do if you prefer, you can unclip that back piece and that will make this whole um, leash into one big one as you, um, so you have a longer leash as you walk together. With it clipped in the front, it will readjust their body back towards you as they pull. If you only clip the back piece, what will happen is they will pull you like a sled dog, just like the other harnesses. So you just want to make sure that um, you at least have the front clipped, but both sides will help to have the, um, you clip both sides, it will help to keep their spine in alignment as they're turned back towards you. So you can see just as I unclip it, that chest piece falls right down here, and it'll come right back over his head. Uh, again, those three prongs are right there, so you'll know if it's backwards if those three prongs are not in your left hand.